Sega Europe is a digital publisher. We publish both uh, physical box and also digitally across the internet. We, we're a company of about 1,000 a a thousand users across Europe, and there's also other territories, uh, which are separate companies within Sega. We also have a large number of game testers, both internal to the company and external to the company. Depending on the development cycle of a game, we could have anything from 300 to 1,000 game testers at a time. Sega Europe traditionally hosted a lot of its uh, uh, infrastructure for online services within a, within a co-located data centre. Um, it was very rigid and a lot of upfront costs. Um, we started looking at cloud, the cloud to improve the agility of the company and also to improve the speed in which we could provide a service to the customer. Uh, we wanted to have an environment that we, that we understood end to end um, using the, the VMware standardization within, within the cloud. We could be sure that, you know, what servers we were using, what the back end platform is and what it's been built on. VMware's sort of standard uh, cloud accreditation, uh, which Colt have, have followed, um, gives us that and gives us the ability to, to, to have a data center all over Europe using Colt. Um, so we could, we could start a data center in, in, in Germany or in the UK, uh, which for us has benefits on latency um, for our customers. Once we had uh, developed and rolled out the system to our game testing environment, the benefits were very obvious uh, to begin with. Uh, for one, it was cutting down the time in which we had to wait for the game testers to receive the code. And, and the, the code became on demand. When the test game tester needed it, it was, it was available, rather than there being um, an, essentially a, a, a time slot in the project plan laid out uh, just for the delivery of the code, which was, which was no longer needed. So the time in which a, a, a game would take to test, we're looking at around 70% 70, 70 less time needed uh, in the game testing implementation. Once we had rolled out the code delivery system, uh, we're able to start looking at the, the costs that were involved uh, with, with the external testers downloading the latest code. And we can start streamlining some of our, some of our iterations of, of game test builds, uh, which in turn has, has saved costs. Sega having an efficient code delivery system for its testers has meant that we can cut down on the amount of time testing takes, which in turn gives us more time to test. Uh, this means that the end product is a, is a, is a far more uh, efficient, bug-free game, which is brilliant for the, for, for the gamer themselves. Sega Europe is a, is a heavily virtualized company. We're looking uh, about 80% 80 80 virtualized on the VMware platform. Uh, when we're looking for a cloud service provider, uh, we had to be sure that the two were compatible. While working with Colt and VMware on this project, it's, it's proven that there is a brilliant working relationship between the two companies. Um, we had no problems with project management between the two and the communication was excellent. Working with Colt on this project has been excellent. They're already a world-class internet service provider. Uh, their communication and project skills are superb. Uh, it, it's, it, it's been a pleasure. Sega as a company needs to uh, reduce the amount of footprint that it has in its co-location data centers. We are now looking at using Colt and VMware to move a lot of our game environments, our online game environments, into the cloud. Um, the major issue we have with this is we need, to be, we need to make sure that we're developing the game from very early on, on this environment. Using a hybrid cloud solution gives us that private development environment. But then also when it's ready to go live, we can then look at simply moving it onto a public cloud with Colton.